This is Pat Nadesan, Maths teacher, Takana Park Church of England School. We are looking for today part two, expand and simplify for two brackets. Focus on the C grade work. So we are looking for today. So the expand and simplify for the two brackets. Just for examples now, 5 bracket 2x plus 3 minus 3x minus 1. So in the part 1, I will explain to you how to expand the single brackets. So we got that one single bracket here, another single bracket here. So when you expand the two single brackets, then after the expand, then we'll see how we can simplify. So expand means multiply. So the two, five times two x is come to ten x. You have to multiply that. Then plus here. Then 5 times 3 is gives 15. So that 5 times 2, 10, then x plus 5 times 3 is 15. The next one is minus. Minus is a very dangerous. Is minus is changing your life as well. Because of the minus, you, you might lose your one mark. And that one mark affect your A star, affect your A, affect your B, and affect your C as well. So you have to make sure when the minus comes, you have to be careful. Because the minus is a very, very, very dangerous. So you have to make sure that please. So we got a minus here. Now minus, then plus here. Because there's no sign means it's plus. So remember, I already explained that SNL method, sign number letter. So when you expand and simplify, or expand the single brackets for any questions, you have to make sure, little bit song on that, SNL, sign number letter. So sign minus into plus is come to minus then 3x now the dangerous point I already mentioned to you minus is a dangerous we got a minus here we got a minus here so make sure you have to make sure minus times minus is come to plus so that's the dangerous point then you multiply the number so very simple and clearly Expand each time you multiply and put it. So 5 times 2x is come to 10x. Plus 5 times 3 is come to 15. Then minus 3 times x come to minus 3x. The dangerous point is minus. Minus times minus is come to plus. 3 times 1 is 3. We done the expand. We done the multiplication part. Now we simplify. This is to expand. So you got the one marks already. Now, you're talking about the simplify. When you simplify the plus and the minus, or plus and plus, you have to make sure how to remember that. You can think about the steps. Plus means you're going up. Minus means you're going down. So, 10x, that means plus 10x. You're going up, 10 steps up. Minus three. Then from there you're coming down three steps. So now you should know where you are now. Up still, up means plus. How many steps up? Seven steps. So that's come to seven x. So when you simplify these two. The next one, plus 15. So you're going 15 step up. Then again, plus three. From there you can go another three steps up. So still you are up. Up means plus. How many steps up? 18 steps. That's it. So, you have to make sure when you simplify the 
The people make a mistake. The people make a mistake when you simplify, they think plus into minus, they put minus here. But you have to make sure when will happen when the plus times minus. We are not times it here, we simplify. So how to simplify plus, you can talk about the number line as well. And the meantime, you can't do number line all the time. The quick way you can think about the steps. Plus means I'm going up. Minus means I'm going down. So 10x, you're going 10 steps up. Minus 3. From there, you're coming down because of the minus. Minus means coming down. Plus means going up. So minus 3, you're coming down 3 steps. So still you are up. Up means plus, but you don't have the plus in the front. How many steps up? 7 steps. So 7x. Now plus 15, you're going 15 steps up. Then plus 3, from there 3 steps up. So you have to make sure this you are up. How many steps? 18. That's it. See how they're easier. Now, I'll just give that for four questions. You have to try the four questions. I think you can take each one for one minute. Then after we'll go through the answers. And then, now, I'll give the four question, you have to try now. So, there's the four question, to try now. times 3 is come to 6 plus 5 times x means they are 1 there so that's come to plus 5 times x is 5x then plus times plus is plus 5 times 1 make sure you times it not adding some people thinking 5 1 5 plus 1 they might put the 6 here you have to make sure expand means multiplication so 5 times 1 is 5. Now you have to simplify. 4x plus 5x. Up, up. So it's 9x. Plus 6. Going up 6 steps. Plus 5. Again 5. So still up. Plus 11. That's it. Let's the question number 2. 3 times 5y. 15y. Plus 3 times 1 is 3. Minus is a dangerous. Minus 4 times y is minus 4y. Minus into minus is come to plus. When you simplify minus and minus, it's going down. So minus times minus because expand it. So minus times minus is plus. Then 4 times 2 is come to 8. Now you have to simplify 15y going up 15 steps. Minus 4 means coming down. So still you up. Plus, so how many steps up? 11y plus 3, 3 steps up, plus 8 again, so that's come to plus 11. So the next one. 7 times 2p is come to 14p, minus 7 times 3 is come to 21, minus, there's no number means there's a 1 there. So minus 1 times 3p is minus 3p. Minus is very dangerous. Minus into plus is come to minus. 1 times 1 is come to 1. Now you simplify. 14p minus 3p is come to 14 up. Minus 3 coming down. Still up means 11p minus 21. You're going 21 step down because minus means going down. Minus 1 again down. So minus 21. You're going 21 steps down. Minus 1 again, 1 step down. So where are you now? You are in the down. So down means minus. How many steps down? All together 22 steps. So to minus 22. The last one. 10 times 10x. 10, 10 
then minus 10 times 5 is 50 plus 3 times 2x plus 6x plus times minus is minus 1 times 3 is 3 when you simplify 10x plus 6x is automatically 16x minus 50 down 50 down again all together down so 50 and 3 53 minus 53 don't think minus into minus don't put a plus here when you multiply this is simplified that means think about the number line minus 50 again minus 3 so i'm talking about the steps to make it easier minus means going down plus means going TV and the next one part 3 we are looking for expand and simplify for double brackets thank you bye now